Today we're going to review the North Face Thunder Micro Jacket. We're here at, uh, at my sports warehouse and this is the Thunder Micro Jacket. Now, I know it doesn't look like a jacket, but this is one of the coolest parts about this jacket is that it folds up into one of its hand warmer pockets. So that's pretty cool. As we take this apart, if I pull on the right end, um, one of the things that drew me to the North Face jacket versus all the other jackets was, for me, the fit. Um, I tried all the other jackets on, uh, the Patagonias, the Mountain Hardware, the Marmots, um, and uh, none of the fits uh, fit me right. Either the arms are weird, or it was too long around the waist, or too tight, or, or I don't know. I don't think I'm that weird of a body type, but for me, it just didn't, it didn't work. And when I tried on the North Face one, it was just, it was a thing of beauty. It just fit perfectly. This is a 800 fill lightweight down jacket. Another term that they kind of use for it is uh, a down sweater. Um, mainly because it's so thin that it is typically designed as a layering item uh, that you would put under a parka, uh, much like a sweater. Uh, but the fit for me, and I'm, I'm an average size guy, six foot, 185, um, but the fit for me is just perfect. The sleeve length, this is a large, the sleeve length, the, uh, the waist length, um, the, the way it fits me through the size, it's not too big, it's not too bulky, um, it moves well, um, and uh, I, just, I just really like it. The other thing that I like about it, kind of vain I know, is how the, uh, the pockets go this way over the shoulders, the pockets, you know, the pockets where they put the down. I guess you'd call them pockets. Um, it goes this way over the shoulder and then this way across the chest. Just gives it a really look, a really cool look. Um, under the arms you have the uh, North Face flash dry fabric. Um, it's a stretchy material. Um, allows the body to vent its heat and uh, without, you know, soaking um, the down and everything else because when down gets wet it's it doesn't do you any good. And uh, some of the other things that I like about it is the weight. It's freaking 14 ounces, which is awesome, especially when it's in like this little ball pouch. And uh, yeah, I think the only thing that I was that I didn't really like about it that was kind of surprising um, is that it wasn't as warm as I thought it would be. Now, I didn't have grandiose expectations. I didn't, you know, think it was going to be a Mount Everest expedition jacket. But my first time using it, it was about 50 degrees and it was uh, Southern California, we were up in the high desert, and I felt a little cool, to be honest. I was wearing just a t-shirt, just like I am today, underneath it, and uh, it, I, I, wasn't do, I wasn't being active, I was just, you know, hanging around the camp, but uh, I needed another layer, um, or at least a long sleeve layer to keep my temperature up, so um, not as warm as I thought it would be, but I wear it all the time, I love it, um, and uh, it's easy to keep clean with these flash dry underarms, uh, because I can spot clean the underarms, um, if you sweat a lot, it's easy to, you know, make the jacket smell. And so uh, with the flash dry, I can easily uh, clean that up. So it's a great jacket. I'm a big fan. And uh, I, if you've been looking for a, um, a lightweight down jacket, I highly recommend the North Face Thunder Micro Jacket.